Hello, this is Andrew Friskup. I am the North Dakota State University Serial Extension Plant Pathologist, and today I am going to show you an example of how to use the NASU Pest Management app. Uh, in this case, I'm going to say I'm a corn farmer in North Dakota and have an issue with common cockaber. Uh, so using the pest management app, the way I would get to information for common cockaber control in corn would be select the host crop, corn, select the pest, in this case it's a weed, and then look at common cockaber itself. Uh, however, if I'm not quite sure if it is common cockaber, notice you can click on the picture and it gives you a cotyledon uh, type of picture. Notice use this as a tool, uh, it's just more of a supplemental resource. So once I'm positive it's common cockaber, I'm looking at the type of application I want to make. Well, in this case I want to make a post application, a post emergent application. Um, Notice I have a variety of options that I can use for this, uh, but for this case, I'm going to say I'm going to use Banville or uh, Dicamba on this. Um, note I have the active ingredient, uh, the type of mode of action uh, that it may have. Note in this one, the specific site is unknown. Uh, the target weed is any broadleaf weeds, when to apply, and any other remarks that can go through with this. So following these information, uh, you can give you a relatively good idea of how well Banville would work on common cockaber. Um, for any kind of other general info, perhaps you want to look at an adjuvant or any other supplemental information, uh, we can always go through that way too into any other further information. So I hope you enjoyed this quick video on how to use this pest management app when you have a weed control problem in your field.